Hello my loves, today we are back in Baldur's Gate and today I'm going to be doing my usual of creating different franchise characters in Baldur's Gate and today we are doing Karomi from Sanrio. I'm really excited to do this one um, so we're gonna get started. First of all I feel like she would be a drow. Um, this girl's a baddie and she knows what she wants and she will put her foot down and say that she wants it. I just feel like Drow works for her. Um, sub race, I haven't really thought about actually. Um, seeking allies from Faerun, aiming to settle their conflict. Um, I feel like Karomi could do that. I feel like she's quite on it. Like she wants to get stuff sorted. She won't just sit back and watch. So I think we're going to go for that. Um, I do feel like she would be a rogue. Um, I just feel like it fits her so well. I can't see her really in any of the other roles as well as I do with rogue. So I think I'm going to go with that. And then we want her background. Uh, unfortunately, I am not that deep into Chromie's lore. Um, I don't know. She has a background this deep. I know a lot about Sanrio, but not Karomi's background um criminal maybe she looks like a criminal um sometimes she behaves like a criminal um so that could work um you know what's great we're going criminal i just think it would be hilarious to see Kiromi in a little rogue outfit being a criminal um i need to see that happen like with actual Kiromi doing it i think it would be adorable okay then we need to choose a face. What gives like the most Karomi vibe? She's very cheeky. Um, I'm not sure any of these are catching the cheeky vibe that I'm going for. Um, so I'm unsure. I think maybe that or maybe this one. I think I'm going to go with this one. I think this one will work the best. I wish I could like curve the lips a little. Um, and change the eyebrows. Um, Karomi is very, very white, um, but then she does also have the black and purple theme too. So I think I'm going to go for this um, as like her base skin, and then I'll do her hair as if it were her hat. Um, I think that's the best way for us to do it. Um, she doesn't have freckles, but I want to give her freckles because I think it's cute to do. We turn those decently up, maybe like to here. I feel like that works. Um, does Karomi have a scar? Do we give her a scar in the universe of Baldur's Gate? I like you feel like she does, but I don't know. I feel like people are going to be mad at me for this. Um, I want to give her this one. I just, I don't know. I'm getting vibes guys, I'm sorry. And then we want to do her eye colour. They're pretty jet black. Um, but I'd like, if we could maybe get a black and purple like that, that could work really well. I think I'm going to go for the black and purple. Um, we'll check the other purples first. That could also work. Which one? Which should we go for? I feel like this works. This or this one? Which one? I'm going to go for this one because it's more pigmented and a, a deeper purple which works for her um she obviously doesn't have tattoos but her hat has the little design in the middle so maybe we could get something to represent that but i'm kind of doubting it um i'm not sure like tattoos work for the vibe we're going for and i don't think we're gonna find anything that kind of works for Karomi, so I think we will uh, we'll leave the tattoos for now. Um, and then piercings, we want some cute ear piercings. I quite like these. I feel like they work really well for her. Um, I do like these, but the colours aren't really giving Karomi. Um, a septum could work for her. Um, I do like the original rings, although the bard rings also look really cute. I think, no, I think we'll go for the first rings that we, we had on. 
um, I went past them. Is this them? This is them. Okay, cool. Eye makeup we want quite dark. I'm thinking maybe that. I feel like this is better. We obviously want it black. Tint all the way up. Um, do you want any glossiness? Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit of metallic too. Um, so we want that tint to go up to on the lips. Um, I'm torn between like black lips and um, purple. So shall we? Shall we try them all? What's this? This is like a deep purple. See, I feel like this is way too shiny. Um, and you know, it's not. We haven't even got metallic or glossy on, and it's that shiny. Um, so that concerns me. I'm not sure about that. I feel like this is cute, but again, it's very shiny. Um, what does the metallic... Yeah, you can... I'm not sure the metallic is what I'm go... I did not mean to do that. Um, I just... I think black may be the better choice aesthetically here. Um, and then what do we have left? we have her hair to do i feel like her hair is quite important um it's gonna be purple or black for the for her hat with pink highlights i think um but we need to find one that kind of represents hiromi i feel like this could maybe work um but where where is the one that i seek come to me i feel like this could work because kind of like horns um, kind of like her hat, um, but also, I'm gonna find them, there we go, the buns, I feel like the buns could also work really well, um, oh, after all of that, I am actually thinking the hair that I just had on, wherever it's gone, this one, do we, no, I think I want the buns, I'm sorry, I'm indecisive, Okay, I feel like the buns are more Karemi. We're going to go buns. Um, so we'll go for black. Can we, like, turn the black up? First of all, turn highlight intensity up. And let's let's get some purple in there. We want that deep, dark purple. That one. I mean, we could put pink in as well because there's the little pink, it, uh, pink bit on her hat. But I do feel like purple is just much more... Her colour, to be honest. Black, purple and white are the vibes I get for her. I think I'm going to go for this one. Um, I didn't even realise she had a little nose piercing. That's adorable. Okay, and then greying. We're just going to put it on black. So just darken it. I wonder if, if we turn it up. It'll kind of make the black a little darker. It does lovely stuff. Okay, and it blends in really well with her hair. So, this is a uh, Karomi. Obviously, the outfit is not what I would like to see her in. Um, I feel like there's some really cool outfits that you would be able to get for her. Um, but just as a basic starter, this is my interpretation of Karomi in Baldur's Gate. Um, I love her. I think she's so cute. But I'm going to end it there. Um, if you want to request any characters, I'm happy to do them from any franchise um, possible. I love doing this. It's so fun. I'm hoping to eventually do all of the Sanrio characters. Um, I can't remember if I did Hello Kitty or not yet. I've got a feeling that I did. But I've also got this little thing in the back of my head like, no, you didn't. You're lying. You're, you're spreading lies. You never did that. So I'm not entirely... I can't remember. I don't know. But I'd like to do all of the Sun Rear characters. I've done Dead by Daylight. Um, Overwatch is the one I've done the most. Overwatch is what kind of kicked it off. Um, I can't... Was my first one Mercy, maybe? I don't know. I'm rambling. But, yeah. Any characters that you would like to see, just drop a comment um if you have any suggestions of what would fit them whether it's class or race or background or even elements of their appearance um i always love when people do that and of course if you want me to mention you in the video for the idea i'm absolutely happy to 
So thank you for watching. I swear I'm going now. Goodbye. <laughs>